Welcome back for another playthrough of Cartoon Network Plus Time Explosion XL Arcade Level Playthroughs. Now today we won one of my next favorite mains in this game. And today we'll be playing as a teenage Ben Tennyson. Ben Tennyson. He has some awesome colors. He has uh, Alberto, which is his arch enemy. The African American Ben Tennyson. The dark one. And his astronaut costume. But shall we? You know what? No, I don't care what nobody says. We're using the astronaut costume. So leave a like on the video if y'all want more Cartoon Network Crunch Time Explosion XL playthroughs. It's always appreciated for your boy. And let's get to it. Me and Bob will be discussing about the series. So let's go. <clears throat> Sim thinks that way. I'm going to get to the burn with this. Ben shouted as his armor chips began to glow. Even though Ben was in an unfamiliar universe, the intergalactic hero prepared himself to save it, no matter what trials he would have to face. Yeah. Team Powerpuff Girls again. Alright, I don't have a problem with that. Oh! Speaking of which, we're fighting Vilgax as our arch emesis already, with young Ben 10 in our squad. This is absolutely great. Phil Gax is our first appointment as soon as we start the video. Isn't that ben amazing, Bob? Versus Phil Gax. Now, it's on versus. Yeah, it's on motherfuckers. Three, two, now, while watching one, Ben 10 while five. I was growing up, um, the, the only series I liked the best was the Ben 10 Alien Force. That's a classic one was him as a 10 year old boy. He has. Ben 10 while growing up was um, my favorite um, series of Ben 10 was Ben 10 Area Force and wow and I never we have seen it. Scotsman that we have to fight and then he'll be our ally against Father and Tornator. So I'm gonna trust Kyle's judgment on this. Yeah, cause I've never seen the it. young Ben Tennyson, which he was a ten year old boy. Um, he has the power of the Omnitrix to turn himself into ten awesome aliens in that series. Ten of Yes. I mean, I'm talking about the actual ten. Oh, hold on. We have Ben Ten Synergy partner, and he's with Fred Fredberger. Is that why it's Tennyson? Yep. Because we got ten. And now do I have the Aryan Force? Um, hold up, man. The Aryan Force. Yeah, he got turned into 15 year old, and he has new Aryan forms that he could change, which is like Schwampfire, Humongousaur, um, Echo Echo, what else? Um, Spider Monkey, that's one of them. Spider Monkey. Then Goop, um, Jetways there, and even Aryan X. Wow. So that's some new. Um, alien forms that I got to share with y'all, and they were the best to me. The, the Alien Force was my favorite series while growing up, and even Kevin Eleven decided to help um, Ben Tennyson. Kevin Eleven, yeah, the one that we fought twice in my videos, and now we don't even know if he's gonna be a wow in this playthrough. And that looks like you got a roll of toilet paper on his head. That's Tornado from Kids Next Door. Yeah, because basically we didn't face these guys while we're number one. And now we're Ben Tennyson trying to take care of these guys for him while he's on a roller coaster. Or a carnival that you might say. And speaking of which, we have another Kids Next Door bird named the Sticky Bear. Big ass can? Yeah. That blasts us out a big ass cotton candy ball, Paul's. Toilet paper head. Yeah. The toilet paper head's name is uh, Tornator, just Tornator. so you know. Oh. And we took those guys back to jail once again. So, yeah, that's done. Hope they stay in there, because I don't want them breaking out of jail a lot of times. 
Breaking into jail. What's he in jail for? Well, committing a lot of crimes. A lot of crimes. Yeah. What they did was all messed up in the head. All right, Peter. Looks like he's busting ice cubes. And I didn't know these ice cubes are like energy cubes in this game. Energy cubes. First saw them. They were like, whoa, are those actually ice cubes for what they're dropping out? That doesn't make no dang on sense. So I read the information about this game. Um, yeah, they basically um, call energy cubes that you fill up your meter for um, your punch time explosion meter, which you can see right there between me and Aku here. Um, basically, once you fill it all the way up, you get your PTE. As you saw, number one's punch time explosion, it was the best in this game. So don't get me wrong, his super move is absolutely great, along with Johnny Bravo's as well. So in my own opinion, number one's punch time explosion is great, along with Johnny Bravo. Vent 10's is badass, teenage version. Yeah. Well, you may or may not see it in this video, but I'll try my best to get it. They are beating the shit out of each other. Yeah, and we're fighting Captain Knuckles all by ourselves. And there's no Flapjack, that's good. But too, but too bad you don't see him in this video, but maybe in the grand video we might. Who knows? Come on. And I, and I hate about this um, transition ship because you move way out of the shit to a... Uh, oh, Knuckles is done for. Get yeah, out of here. Ship. Yep, that's how area transitions work. Like that right there. You us all. And that's my favorite area in this series. And I won. It's hero time! It's hero time, my friends. It's hero time. Wow, are you for real? We fought Tornado and took him to prison, and now he's helping me against Dexter and a Darwin for Monkey? That's the third time we're facing these guys. We fought them as number one and semi Jack, and now it's time for Ben 10 to take Dexter outside of his house to do some exercise. Let's see how this works out. Tornier, do not let me down. Or else, I'll take you back to jail. With father. And another awesome area in this big chill, because he has the power of ice. That's why he has the power of ice to freeze all of his enemies. And then Swampfire, he basically has the power of fire. And for all the children out there, ice is bad. Yeah, ice is so bad. Don't ever have Never ice ever. in your your life. Otherwise, you're gonna catch ammonia and have to go to jail or die. No, I I fucked up. We lost, that's fine. We can, we can try it again. I'm gonna take a break. Oh, hey. Just grab a seat while we talk. Oh, hey. We lost once, that's okay. Johnny Bravo, we did awful. We don't want to talk about it. This is all about Ben 10. This is all about Ben 10. And now, a YouTuber friend of mine named OMG WTF LLFT WBLB has done amazing playthroughs of this game. And if you want to check them out, click that I icon right there. And um, you'll be glad to hear some support from him. Just subscribe to his channel, show him some love, show him some respect, and honor to the channel. And it means I lost again? What the fuck? I wasn't even paying attention. Dexter, shut the fuck up. You need to get out of the damn house. Do some exercise. And look, I wasn't even paying attention. Because I was getting my ass whooped. Look, it's okay. That is all right, because we're going to get this dub. And we're going to move on to the next fight. Watch. 
Just watch. Tornado. If you fail me again, you're going to jail. Keep your eyes on the game. I didn't get my sister. Now that area right there, boys, down specialist. I'm assuming it's Asmith Fibion, if I'm not misunderstanding, because he was in the Ultimate Alien series. And yet, um, myself, in my own opinion, um, the the Alien Force is much better than Ultimate Alien, because that final episode, um, it was like extremely dramatic because of that arch emphasis of Aboto. And he teamed up with Phil Gax to join forces against Ben Tennyson. And they would and um, the mystery of him were good. And here we go. We got Kevin Eleven and young Ben Tennyson as ourselves that we teamed up with against Phil Gax. And now we're about to take them on. Here we go. And yep, right there, Kevin Eleven was the arch emesis of Young Ben Ten while they were young. And now since they're grown as teenagers, they work together to work for the mysterious missing of Grandpa Tennyson. And now he shook hands with Ben Ten, and now they're working together to find Grandpa Max, and yet i watched the episode before when Grandpa Max sacrificed himself to save the whole entire uh, world against the evil, disgusting, alien, monster-looking motherfuckers. And Ben Tim was like, No! Grandpa Max, don't do it! And he did. And um, Gwen just covered up everyone. And um, she just covered up... Uh, Ben, Kevin, and even uh, Ben's, uh, I mean, Gwen's brother, um, what is it, like, Pan or something? Yeah, I think that was Pan. And, uh, yeah, that, that, I don't even like how he, oh, hold on, we're showing out Ben's ultimate move, hopefully my game doesn't crash, do not break. Thank you. You, you, I may try to get it again, but I only get to show out the super move once or twice. Like, um, OMG, WTF, um, LOL, um, FTW, BRB, and you, he only showcases the moves whenever he didn't pull them out. Um, yeah, I, 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 I can only show out my super moves once. And now we're facing against Johnny Bravo. We played as him in our last couple of videos, and we call him a semi-jack. And now we're facing him with Ben Tennyson. Let's see what you made of Johnny. And if you fail, then you're absolutely the worst character. I mean, I know he's that good, but I try my best to play good as him, even though I did. But, uh... He's either E tier or F tier in my favor. Ben Ten is at B tier. And then um number one's at A tier. He's fun as hell. I'll tell y'all that much. He's literally fun. Don't get me wrong. He's literally the fun character for me to play as. And now this fight right here that we fought at Semi Jack is no fun. Kick off explained this multiple times. This fight is no fun. It's so hard. Pause. And when you fight them in all modules layer, which you see right here, it's just awful. The only way to win this game is the neutral jump right at the start, which I'm gonna showcase, which I'm gonna show y'all right here, like I did with some of my jack. So let's neutral jump right away. And no, walk way back time. God, not the Beetle Buzz. No, also from Ben 10. Come on. No. It's sticky, 
beer. I thought I got him, but it puts everyone in the summer game. No match for you, man. So that's the person who just lost a flashback in the story mode, Sephiroth. And speaking of Gwen, Gwen can only assist you to protect yourself from any other enemies. And thanks for the help, Gwen. And Gwen's synergy partner is with Blossom. And we didn't get to see Blossom's synergy partner because I got her. So. Yes, I know how that works. <coughs> this is over right here. If I win this game, then I'll move on to the final battle. And I know, it's just a game. They don't come out of the electronic shit. It's just a game. Like in that Johnny Bravo video, uh, they come out of the desk. I've saved the whole entire universe. But yet, it's just a Dagon game. What's the difference? And look at that, we got all three KOs on the Powerpuff Girls. And now we won the final battle, or the last fight on the Song K ladder, and it will always end up with him, the devil. So this is just a fun video. So I'm glad this is gonna be uploaded by the time we get done doing this one, and Grim's gonna be next. And yes, once we're done with this, Gwen will be next, and then we'll move on to Captain Planet for last. So now, let's see what you made out of him. And if you, if you, act, and speaking of that, him really, really sucked in this game. Oh shit. That was a close call. Ah, uh, fuck, I cannot attack. I cannot attack. Come on! Major boy, do something. And by the way, him is always gonna be easy at this last fight. Like, he will always be easy. Always. Stepping into another portal, Shut Ben prepared the face to well, yeah, the I mean, it's gonna take, I'm gonna get ready to continue. Probably and yeah, this is here. not the good ending. Tank, it only know, has one sentence right there, and then that's it. I'm gonna give this a six out of ten. Even though this was a fast video, we did good up there. We did. Oh yeah, this calls for some Mr. Smoothie. Yep, you heard that, folks. This celebration calls for some Mr. Smoothie. And with that, this is going to be a Ben 10 video right here that I got for you guys for the day. And I try to give out some good information of Ben 10, and yet, we did good out there, and we had a lot of fun with Ben 10. And thanks to Bob, who helped me out with this video for the day, and I appreciate his support. And if y'all want more of him, just subscribe to my channel, and like the video if y'all want to get to know of him. And I will do it for you all as soon as I can. Until and then. Until then, my guys. Thank you all so much for watching today's video. And I hope you all enjoyed it. And if you all did, make sure you all uh, uh, similar slice the like button. And subscribe if you guys are new. And thank you all for watching a Teenage Ben 10 Arcade Live Playthrough. And I hope you guys enjoy it. And I will see you all in the next video for whatever the hell I'm going to do. So... Thank y'all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, and enjoy your morning.